This video will demonstrate how to stream an IP camera to YouTube Live with open broadcasting software. Here we are on the website showing you how to download it and we're going to save this and then run it. Click yes. It's going to ask you to download a runtime component. It's called the Visual C++. It takes you right there when you hit yes. You're going to save and then run. I agree. And then install. And yes should be relatively quick and you're going to click close. Now you're going to have to locate where you have the installer and we show that you can either download it again or find it within your downloads folder under your documents. And you can either open it or right click and run as administrator and click yes. Next. I agree. Next. Install. This could take a second. You're going to hit finish after this and it should bring up the open broadcasting software. You might encounter an auto configuration wizard and you can just cancel right out of that. And here we're showing that you uh, finally have the program open. And now you're going to want to construct your link um, as written out in the guide and then it'll better tell you how to construct this link. But you know, the RTSP stream with the username and then the password. For example, we're using admin as a user in our, our um, custom password. And this is the IP address of the camera, the port number. And here is the telling the camera what you wish to record or capture on your stream. For this example, we're using channel 1 as we're just using one camera and subtype of 1, which is the substream. So note when you pull this into your OPS or open broadcasting software it's going to be a rather small window here we're saving this file to the desktop naming it camera stream URL so we can save this for later now we're going to bring this in as a source you're going to want to use media source and create a new one you can name it whatever you'd like in this example we're naming it IP camera stream and now you're going to want to uncheck all these as you don't need to it's not a local file we're streaming from uh, another device uh, we can uncheck all these um, they're not necessary. And this is where you're going to want to copy and paste the the stream that you've constructed, the URL that you've constructed into OBS so that it knows where to pull this stream from. Um, provided you've you know constructed your link properly and uh, copied and pasted in here with no leading spaces or spaces at the end, you should be able to pull in your stream. Here we're just going to go to transform and then stretch it to the screen because it is the substream and it will look small um, it's kind of what you see is what you get here as far as your stream to YouTube. And now you're going to want to add your stream key. So we're kind of showing you here that you're going to set up it for YouTube or YouTube gaming is what they have it here. And now we're going to select a primary YouTube and just server. And this is the stream key that you'll be getting from your YouTube account. I'll show you here in a couple of seconds on how you were to get that. To get to your live streaming studio, you're going to first click here. You're going to click My Channel. And you're going to go to YouTube Studio. This brings you to the beta. Um, and they don't support the live streaming, so you're going to go down here to the bottom left, click Creator Studio Classic. And it might prompt you to give them a reason why you're going to, and you can just hit Skip, and this will bring you to the Classic view. You're going to click live streaming, and this will bring you to your live streaming interface. You want to scroll all the way to the bottom, and there's the server URL. We're not worried about that because OBS knows automatically. We reveal this. You're going to want to copy this and then also paste it into the notepad where you have your your URL set up. That way you have this for the future, but make sure you keep this in a safe location that people cannot access. And you can recopy this. And then we're going to paste it right in here to the stream key. And we're going to click OK. And we're going to hit Start Streaming. And provided you have everything set up properly with your YouTube account and your stream key. And you will go up here. And it should say Starting. And then it will say Live Stream Health. And it will say You Are Live. And you can, to stop the recording, you just stop the streaming on open broadcasting software. Thank you for watching this video.